Les agradecemos su paciencia. Las preguntas empezarán en unos instantes. Y con esto termina la rueda de prensa. Gracias por su presencia. The tension is palpable and you can understand why. Two high-level sides about to face each other and it's anyone's guess how this is going to end up. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. It is true to say there's no love lost between these two sides, Real Madrid and Barcelona. And today, they find themselves on a collision course here at the Bernabeu. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position. Sitting alongside me, ready to provide expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. Stuart, it's a privilege to be here. Well, it certainly is, Derek. This is a bitter rivalry between two of Europe's best, and I just can't wait for this one. It should be an absolute classic. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Trent Alexander-Arnold starts with Andrew Robertson in the wide defensive areas. And the main threat in attack today should be Kylian Mbappe. And the shot. The referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. But I'll tell you what, I really admire the fact that Jude Bellingham can do just about everything. He can score, he can set up chances, he can defend. What do you expect to see from him in this game? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. Real find themselves in a position of menace, but nothing comes of it. Rodrigo. Fine goalkeeping to push that away. And the keeper has it after that tension-laden sequence. Well, what a great first save that was. How did he stop that? And intercepted it. Marcinelli. Nicely saved. Frankie de Jong. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely using his physical strength to shield it. Loves to cut in from the wide areas. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. And possession given away. And Real with the ball again. 
succeeded in keeping it in play. Can he do it to take the lead? And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. Barcelona get things going again. A wake-up call for them, perhaps. Joao Cancelo. De Bruyne. Guerrero. Now with James. De Jong. And a goal for Barcelona from the corner here really would change the complexion of the game. in by De Bruyne frantic action from one end to the other they weren't ahead for long and this match is level again well here it is again it's a well delivered ball into the box and what a header it is from Lewandowski he just knows how to get on the end of crosses it's a very good goal Alexander Arnold and he stopped them in their tracks what can Real do from this position? A well, fine reading of the situation. And he's in. And a goal it is to put them in front again. No less than they deserve. Well, first of all, Where's the defending? They're all over the place. But give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. Well underway again. It's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. Guerrero on the ball. Bruno Guimaraes. Spot on with that challenge. Oh, in with a chance. Well, he had the chance. He went for power. He might be regretting that now. Well, he got his angles all wrong there. That's a poor miss. Stegen. Bruno Guimaraes. Frankie de Jong. This is Robert Lewandowski. Marcinelli. Well, he's gone back to give the free kick, the referee here. He tried to play advantage, but it didn't accrue. Robert Lewandowski waits at the back post. Just the clearance that was needed. Now breaking at pace, potential danger. And he might be through here. And it's in! Real Madrid firmly in charge here. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Joao Cancelo. Gabriel Martinelli. Kunde. And now Stones. Lewandowski. An encouraging move from Barca. Chances on, 
And a decent save for credit. And short it is. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Vinicius. Oh, big chance. Can they stop it going in? Smuggled away. Joao Cancelo. And that is that half-time here in the Spanish capital. And on the evidence of what we're seeing in this match, Kylian Mbappe is a striker at the peak of his powers, you've got to say, Stuart. Well, his skill level to go past defenders and get shots away has been excellent today. The only surprise, he's just got the one goal. So back in business here, and it was a below-par effort from Barcelona in the first half. Will they fare better in the second? De Bruyne. Showing a real will to win the ball. Well, it's a tall order as they try to pull one back, but the passing game might help. Marcinelli, and crossed in there, and clears the danger. In a decent position now. Marvellous anticipation! Clear deflection off the defender there. Now, how about the short corner? Oh, he's blocked it! And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. to pull one back oh off the post still alive well that's a sad end to the attack a more live La Liga action for you to look forward to here on EA TV it's Real Madrid facing Girona I like the look of that game the atmosphere is always good inside that stadium and two very good teams well they stopped them in their tracks The Marengues have lost the ball. Kunde. It's with Joao Cancelo. Joao Cancelo. Martinelli. Played it to the centre. Clears it away. Now we have 30 minutes to go. Vinicius Junior. A glorious chance. He can't hold on to it. Well, they can keep possession of it now. And another treat from La Liga coming up for you live here on EA TV. It's Barcelona, and they'll be facing Real Oviedo. Well, that should be a really good game between two entertaining teams in a great stadium. Decent cross, but nobody in the vicinity. And credit due, a good intervention. The conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Torres. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Absolutely nothing wrong with the idea, but no end product. Mbappe. 
Mbappé. Kylian Mbappé. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And that's a top-class finish from Mbappé. He hits that with such control. That's a brilliant goal. Well, on they go again, and Real very much in control. Feeding it through. In it goes! But it will not stand. Offside, Stewart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. And in the right position to read it. Oh, big chance! And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick! Absolutely unplayable today! What a performance! Well, this is worth watching again. Mbappe beats the challenge with such ease, and Mbappe just hits it with such confidence. He strikes it so cleanly. It's a great goal. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. De Jong. And Torres on the ball. De Bruyne, able to skip past his man. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. An example of how to press. Mbappe, and he's made headway. There it is, a fantastic goal, and no wonder he's off celebrating. Here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. Really, the goalkeeper should never be exposed that easily. Great team goal, but won't be defended. Joao Cancelo. Jules Koundé on the ball. Bruno Guimaraes. Frankie de Jong. De Jong. Torres. Now winning back possession. This might be ideal for the counter. Giving it a try. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. This is going to be a double substitution. Well, Real Madrid are going to make a double substitution. <laughs> Playing it short. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Decent acreage for Real Madrid to run into. 
big chance. And there is the goal. He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and the timing of the run is just as good. As for the finish, it was never in doubt. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Ansu Fati. Nicely cut out. Stones. Jules Kunde on the ball. Teammates available. Lukaku waiting, putting them under the cosh. Still looking to get the shot off. Able to get his body in the way. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. And knocked out of there. Nicely timed tackle. So there goes the final whistle. Real Madrid victorious, and their fans are going to be happy with this. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. Tengo varias preguntas que hacerle, pero antes me gustaría darle las gracias por su tiempo. Gracias por las respuestas.
There is nothing quite like match day inside a football stadium, especially when there's so much on the line. The build-up has been intense, and now we just can't wait for us all. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the southeastern part of Girona. We're at the Estadio de Montelini. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. And the focus is on one of the finest leagues in world football, La Liga. It is Girona facing Real Madrid. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. They'll be doing a fine job of protecting the ball. And here's the Girona starting 11. Well, in this 4-5-1, as you would expect, it's a very compact back four. Oh, they could be in here, Stuart. Attacking possibilities for Real. Cutting infield here. Valverde. Wonderful chance. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Delivering it. Oh, not on the target. Space was at a premium, though.
Henry. Well, the Merengues have been wonderfully free scoring this season. Just look at the record to back that up. Well, their build up play away from home has been brilliant. They get the ball into the front players with quality. They get midfield players making runs beyond the strikers. And the fullbacks are always ready to overlap. I'm sure we'll see the same again today. Mukoko. Real Madrid have given it away. Oh, he's through here. In it goes. That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. Well, as you can see, it was a fairly simple finish in the end, but you still have to be in the right place, keep your composure and finish it off, and that's exactly what he did. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Here's Valverde. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. And did well to keep hold of it while waiting for the support to arrive. That's effective pressure high up the pitch. Oh, fine stop. Well, the crowd know that set pieces could be their best chance. Just listen to that reaction. Well, they're getting close, but he knows they need to be more clinical. Well, opting for the short corner. Very quick thinking there. Oh, another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. And taken short. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Yangel Herrera. Well, that's an attractive passing move, but it's all about finding an equaliser here. Well, the hopes rise as they win a corner. Played over, and a bit short with the clearance. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. Realising that it might be opening up on the opposite flank. Will he finish? And hit with ferocity, it was close, but not quite good enough. attempt oh and on to the bar well he does everything right great skill good awareness but it just doesn't come down in time really inventive stuff from Real here but the danger averted for now Intense pressure. Vinicius. On to Modric. It's got to be! Oh, surely! And a goal it is for Real Madrid. They are on a victory course. Well, let's have another look, because this is a goal they have thoroughly deserved. They've played really well so far.
Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing the game now. So the ball rolling again at 2-0. And Valverde. Ivan Martin. For now. Valverde with it. Henry. For now. Herrera. Plenty of options. Well, on the cusp of the half-time interval, and I think it's fair to say they're enjoying this away day. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen? Yes, it's been a really energetic display from them so far. The passing's been sharp, the movement from the front players has been excellent, and the finishing has been clinical. They will certainly be happy going in at half-time. He's in behind. Can he convert? And a goal here! There it is! They've done it! Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant from him. Well, on they go again, and Real very much in control. Ball now. Viktor Tsigankov. Oh, good play, this. Really determined play to hang on to it. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Mukoko. He's in here. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. And the referee brings this first half to an end. It's now in the history books here in Catalonia. And the ball rolling again after what was a dazzling first 45 from Real. Can they repeat that in the second half? Promising move. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Vinicius. Mateus Cunha. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Vinicius.
Now with Valverde. Look at Modric. A goal here. Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and the finish is so clinical. He just rolls it past the keeper, cool as you like. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. Oh, my goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Gankov well a really good run and cutting inside firing it in huge block well more live La Liga action for you to look forward to here on EA TV it's Girona and they'll be facing Real Oviedo well, nothing for them to worry about in the end. Good defending. Now, options are plenty. Cuts it back. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Martin. Well, now it's with Ruben Loftus cheek. Really fine play to keep possession. Well, that's the end of that move for now. Good weight on that pass. Rodrigo. Luka Modric at the ready. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Trying to deliver it accurately and clearing his lines. Electing to shoot. He's blocked it. Oh, the referee has given it. Penalty it is. I don't think anyone really questioned him. Well, here it is again. Great composure to send the keeper the wrong way before striking it into the opposite side. That's an excellent penalty. Well, that's not a happy manager. He knows he's got a lot of work to do now. Well, it's an out-and-out out pasting. 6-0. Henry. Well, they'll see it as very disappointing to give it away as cheaply as that. Trying to open up the defence. No, 
well, good work to deny the opportunity. Well, another wonderful save to add to his portfolio. 20 minutes to go. Here's Valverde. Ivan Martin. Well, these fans are starting to make their way to the exits here. The game is surely beyond them now. Perfect tackle. Vinicius Jr. Opportunity here. Oh, it's gone in. And that will be written down as an own goal. No wonder he's hanging his head. Well, here it is again, and quite clearly, that's an own goal. He's a bit unfortunate, really. Alex Garcia. And here's Cunha. Ivan Martin. It's still alive. And the attack fizzling out. Noel. Fran Garcia. Eduardo Camavinga. Real Madrid have given it away. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. And threading it through. Well, that was easy on the eye, and he didn't miss by much. Well, that's how to counter-attack. They did it with such pace, just couldn't finish it off. Given away by Real Madrid. Promising sequence. And they'll get ready for the throw in. For now. Herrera. What to like about that pass? Well, they stopped them in their tracks. This looks promising. And a fine stop. Well, we are going to have a decent amount of stoppage time. Three minutes to be exact. Mateus Cunha. Committed challenge. Henry. Good-looking sequence. And he might be through here. Oh, it's a superb challenge. Very timely. And the short option preferred. And that is that. The end of the game. It goes into the books as a win for Real Madrid. What did you think of their overall performance?
Well, as I keep saying, if you make forward runs and you look to pass the ball forward and have players who can dribble past defenders, you're always going to carry a threat. And that's what they're doing at the moment. Their forward play was scintillating. Muchas gracias por su atención y por contestar estas preguntas. Muchas gracias por su tiempo y sus respuestas.